Oh. What's that? We gotta find shoes. We gotta find a pair of shoes to wear. Before we go outside and walk you, we should just grab something simple. So let us grab a Nikki. Oh, hey. Nope. Back up. Hey, back up. Hey, back up. Omar! Good boy. You leave those. Can you stay right there? I appreciate it. Stay. Thank you, good boy. That's a good boy. That's my good boy. Ow! I burnt my hand. Let me bit it. Hey! Hey! Who are you trying to fight? Who are you trying to fight, son? Who are you trying to fight? Fly! Alright, let's go for a walk. Come on. One more. <sighs> All right, good morning. So, yesterday this box came in. I didn't open it because it came in last night and I wanted to open it here. We'll go ahead and open this. Morning box. MDCS2PK. Yeah, it is a little thicker. I thought it was just off the glance. All right, what's well, that pair? Harvest Red. All right, harvest red. Boom, boom, boom. We'll take a look at these in a little bit. Currently waiting on Ernie. Ernie's gonna swing by, and we're gonna take Omar to the tattoo shop. Everybody wants. To, no one at the shop has even met Omar yet, so we're gonna take Omar with us and have a little day with him there. I have a couple of packages, or at least I know one package that's getting delivered here that I need to make sure I get. And then, um, other than that, not really sure. So. What up? What up, Omar? We'll put him on a guest list then. He's got a snotty nose. Look at this. Yeah. I think it's just allergies. He's got allergies, I think, from being out in the grass. Yeah, it could be. He had it last night. He woke up this morning. He's like pushing little bubbles out of his oh, nose. Yeah. And I was like, dog, you're not allowed to get sick yet. You little handsome guy. You gonna take your crazy ass to the shop. Yeah, we are. I mean, my. My password is like different places. It'll say it's secure. Other places. Let me put it on your nose. Let me put it on your nose. Tomorrow we're going to do. Oh, just getting into trouble. <laughs> That's it. There you go. Hit no. Hit no. I can tell you're a little lover. Yeah, attention star. <laughs> One for sure. day. Say hi. <laughs> Thank you. Hot out here, son. Got air on, son. Oh boy. Uh, Tracy's going in. <laughs> oh, right. oh my god. There's nothing I can do about that. Just breathe in my face. Just breathe in my face. Oh, 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 I love you. Hello, dude. We know that they're poisonous. Animals don't eat them. I hear you're a little shithead. He's like, I'm a puppy. Oh, oh, like a oh, yeah. Yeah. oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Abby's gonna cry. <laughs> what do I have for you? Tell your mom. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I wanna pet him now. Okay, I love you. Okay, bye. What do you think? I'm so in love. 
I can't. He's so small. He ain't that small. He's getting big. Seen these yet? Yeah. Well, not in person. They're really tight. Like the knit is crazy tight. Yeah, tat gat. Yeah, that's fine. Woo. Fun trying to get rid of it or what? Oh, oh, that sounds like butter. That's a chain. So, there's a liner, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, he drove from Florida. Yeah. You had him for two weeks, Ted? Something like that. What are you doing, brother? I love him. We're good because he's probably babysitting him sometimes. So. Yeah. I'm so about that. He walks and he just wobbles. His whole body wobbles. Nah. Yeah, I gotta go change my car tire. Okay. Sounds fucking redneck watch. to me. No, watch out driving in that fucking back alley. That's where it happens. That's what happens, man. You hang out in back alleys, you get back alley problems, son. Once you learn first lesson, first life Look, lesson. Nails and tires. Yep. Lucky that's all you got. Who's going to LA? Are you going? Yeah, I heard in high enough. And, and, and Does that mean that Brandy's gonna be home alone this weekend? <laughs> what are those? I'm not staying long. These? Yeah, These are CS2s. Oh. Yeah. If you wouldn't fucking shop for a few of God bands and bullshit all the time, you'd know what the fuck's going down. I'm you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Make fucking, make fucking eggs. Come on, Omar. Let's <laughs> go. Go. <laughs> Dude, it smells good, huh? <laughs> Man! I'm gonna think that. <sighs> you smell good, partner. Milk chug loves puppy breath. Milk chug loves the puppy breath. You having fun? You having fun meeting everybody? Huh? Oh, Marcel. Good boy. Oh, yeah. Good boy. Good treat, boy. Oh, my God. Good boy, Found a girl, huh? I'm gonna whisper in his ear that I'm his mommy. I mean, wrong ear to whisper into, I would say. <laughs> I was playing with him like that the other day, and he bit. Like he got in my nose and got it and got it, and it was just like gushing blood. He, he like pierced it, like gushing. He didn't mean to. You know, it was my fault. But I was like, oh my! And I was like, oh my god! And then I'm gonna do. I'll send you two versions, one on a white shirt and a black shirt. Okay. On the white shirt, I think I'm just gonna do a black LA. The white shirt, yeah, I'm gonna do a white dragon with a gold LA. You gotta leave some alone time in there? Yeah. yeah. When you could be comfy in someone's lap. <laughs> Where you prefer to be. Yeah. For the next few months until you're 80 fucking Yeah. You don't train your lines. Oh yeah, I know you like these ones. Don't look at yeah. these ones. Yeah, right. <laughs> Those are my favorites. <laughs> you got a bread stand? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying, but I was so busy doing other shit. Thank you. 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 You're welcome. Thank you. See you later. Love you. Love you. Where are we headed? Home. Alright. Then what? Um, I say we go get something to eat. I'm done with that. And I gotta probably start working. Yeah, and then I'll go work on website shit. And then I'm just gonna put <laughs> my brand here. I'll send her on the I'll send her on the light rail. DJ Dirty Earth. Someone said on the vlog I should just feed you a weed brownie every day and record it. You could do that every day. I'd have to go up ten more milligrams. Yeah, until you're just at a thousand. Yeah. We should start you at ten milligrams a day until you reach a thousand and document it. Okay. And document how much work you can't get done. <laughs> I ate 500 milligrams once and I was fucking gone. I used to just crush the fucking decadose. Right now. Ugh. Same thing that I used to dab all day long. Now I take like one dab and I'm like, yeah, I'm fucking straight. Oh my. Sit down. Good oh boy. Good Omar. Did you have fun at the shop? Well, now you're not laying down, but it's okay. It's like, yeah, I had fun. Got some packages. Okay, yeah, so earlier we opened these, which, man, these are actually kind of great. Like, at first, 
this knitting felt really tight, but it's kind of nice. So we'll review these later. Probably not today, because I think I know what's in, well, I do know what's in one of these boxes. Packages came in. Uh, everybody at the shop met Omar today. Let me make sure the mic is still on. A little package came in for Omar. And oh, Omar, Adidas, Boost God, won't focus. 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 There we go. That's my man Greg Fetch, the letter, longtime supporter, and the care package. Fetch is a uh, app for that you can download for pet management. T-shirts and some treats for Omar. And then we got a new Adi dog. Uh, jumpsuit, but he's not, he, he still ain't letting me put it on him right now. They got the two stripes because they don't want to get sued. But yeah, thank you Fetch and everyone at Fetch and of course uh, Greg, Greg at Fetch. I appreciate it and this keychain is pretty cool. The other day I actually filmed the unboxing but forgot to turn the mic on as I tend to do. The old boost toss. Shout out to Tommy for the boost toss shirts. Oh, nice. Yeah, I appreciate that. That was a really nice letter. I don't necessarily need to feel the need to read it out loud, but um, thank you. I appreciate that. Nice. He sent me Bulldog Salt and Pepper Shakers, but I think I actually, believe it or not, already have these. But it is much appreciated and we can use more because, you know, it's a Bulldog family. But yeah, thank you. I have a cookie jar too with the Bulldog on it. Hey, no, 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 nope. leave it. Hey, leave it. It's a fucking razor blade. The version of you, you can't eat it, no. Two hats from Adidas. Uh, two of the same hats, I just got two of them in case I like them. Cause someone said they fit just like the hat I'm wearing, which is probably one of my favorite hats from Adidas. Oh, these are cool with the 3M on the back side, that's nice. Omar, you wanna stop chewing on the box? Omar, quit. Let's see how he's fit. Oh yeah, clutch. These are perfect. Fits the same. I don't remember who told me that, but shout out to you. And it's got minimal branding and a trefoil. Fuck, I'm about to order 20 of these. Hells yeah. Fire. Stoked on the hat. I don't know what this hat's called. Everyone's gonna ask. I don't fucking know what it's called, man. You have to look on the internet. That's the bag it came in though. That helps. Okay, cool. Adidas hats, ordered those. Shout out to Abby for ordering on her credit card because I still cannot check out on adidas.com. Anything, pair of socks, nothing. Can't check out. No, you know, thank God I got plugs all over the fucking world. Is that my mystery inks? I thought this was gonna be the mystery inks, but it's probably, I do not, it's not. So hopefully they'll get here soon. I feel like I'm taking the longest L ever. The mystery inks, by the time they get here, they're probably gonna drop all over the United States. <laughs> Just my luck. <coughs> I've been coughing forever too, God. This should be the, uh, so EQT support, 9370. Should be the leather pack, leather mill pack. Oh, US 12 and a half, fuck. I thought this was gonna be a US 13. These might not fit, so we'll see. These are, it's possible these will be too small, too small for me. Omar, hey, leave it. Well, that's kind of a bummer. Hopefully they're not too small, but the leather hits are pretty nice. Leather and leather, nice little prime net. I might have to have to rip that fucking insole out. It's not supposed to really come out, but we'll see. So tired, guys, like. Today I am so, so tired. I don't know, Omar got me up pretty early, but. Please stop. Omar got me up pretty fucking early and it's just, it's really hot today. I know I'm still wearing a long sleeve, but it's really hot today. This is what we've been waiting on. Shout out to the plug on these. Gotta get them early so we can show you the sample of one of these before it came out. Um, and now we have the retail version here, Ultra Boost Mid, whoa, whoa, whoa. at the Riri version. Uh, does it look the same? It does look the same. I don't think I got fakes. Red and white laces on this one, and this one, 
actually has the proper insole because the sample did not. But the mids are here. These are the hats that are coming out with the pack. The hats, the white and the blue, the red, and love these adjustable straps like this. Jesus, oh, I got nice 3M hits on the back. The same, oh, fuck yes. The hats, telling you, man, deep hats. Welcome back, I welcome back the deep hat vibes of the world, and these are deep. I love it. Why cool hats, they got a little, little inline in them. These are super dope, super, super dope. The shoe that we're all, well, I don't know if we're all waiting for it. A lot of people on the internet don't seem to like this one off first glance, but I personally, off first glance, really like this one. Omar, stop chewing on boxes. All leather on there. This one has an American flag on the inside of it. The other one has a French flag. Dang, suede hits on everything, too. Oh, that ride's nice. We gotta try these on. That real leather. But yeah, there's the energy boost right there. And this is the shoe we're actually gonna look at today. So I'm gonna go put these on and I'm gonna go run around for a little bit. Whoa, look at that damn soul, son. I don't have any energy boost yet, so I'm not used to this. That shit is wild. Crazy. So it's like a full full bed of boost down there. Look at that, a little boost bed. It's kind of a boost rocket ship floor plan, almost. But yeah, these are sick. I'm gonna try these on. Gotta unlace these joints. Oh, nice. These are nice. Ready, Craig? Boy. So, <coughs> let's talk shoes since we got the shoes to talk about. Again, hats, run through time hats. I'm already getting a ton of questions on Twitter on how these fit. They are a little deeper. These are the deepest. These are pretty deep as well, and I would say these are only less deep. It has the inline, but run through time hats are super nice and fresh. Glad to get those. And then let me touch real quick. I'm not gonna review these today. I will give you a comparison tomorrow or the next day or someday on these versus the samples. But one correction that I have, I when I did review these, I said that these were mesh. They are not mesh, they're prime knit. It tricked me because it's very thick and does not feel like you know NMD prime knit or even Ultra Boost prime knit. Normally it's much more like Pharrell's or even the, the Aspen mids. But when I reviewed these, I was like in London and I didn't have anything to compare them to and they definitely felt mesh mesh like so you don't have to be a mesh head you can still get these and you're good to go just a little correction before we go any further because I know I caused a little confusion the shoe that the shoe that we're talking about that people are most definitely gonna sleep on because it's an energy boost and it doesn't have any height behind it and whatever whatever but the shoe is actually super sick I like it but that is the energy boost comes in this black box right here these are still on my feet and this is my first pair of energy boost I tried to get the very first pair that ever came out but my order got canceled and then I kind of lost the vibe and now I don't really care. These, my friends, are better, and I don't even have to have any to know. These are better than any energy boost, simply because they are made of prime knit, where normally it's like some stretch mesh, some craziness like that. This is what the shoe looks like. Many people are calling it a dad shoe, which I don't really quite understand. I can see how the heel cap's a little, the heel area is a little crazy. It does not bother me really like it bothers other people, I don't think. I think this is the most toned down energy boost that I've really seen. It's very, very simple and it's very clean. All PK upper, and this PK is like a really dark gray and then it's got light gray peppered in all up in there. For all intents and purposes, the toe box is a 1.0 ultra boost pattern. So that right away is what drew me to the shoe. Love that look. It's like still my favorite aesthetically. Uh, you have nice buttery, buttery suede on the toe guard. And you also have that same suede on the tongue and the heel. Uh, Adidas performance branding in the heel. Regular TPU plastic cages. 
regular kind of light gray laces sort of match the um, peppered in color but not even really matches more of the stripes honestly than anything someone asked me if they came with extra laces and i said no i didn't check them out oh i'm lying it did come with extra laces black and white i'm tripping hold up i better tweet that out real quick Whew. come on twitter jesus <sighs> now that i've righted that wrong uh yeah so it's a black kind of darkish gray and white lace. I just tweeted that it was black, but whatever. Inside tongue has got a little mesh on the inner layer there. The whole entire heel from basically the front of your ankle all the way back is reinforced with leather, which makes this back heel area very, very sturdy and pretty comfortable. It holds your foot in place pretty nice because this definitely doesn't have, you know, with this movable tongue and this even more open, um, ankle collar you're not gonna have that ultra boost fit where it just like <sighs> grabs your foot you're not getting that but it's really still it's still really really comfortable it reminds me more of the ultra boost st than anything but not quite the same um, it does have an insole that is removable consortium adidas branding there was no consortium account that went with this this was just a consortium release so there is nowhere um you know no special store that is associated with the release um, but the american flag is cool and of course these have the French flag inside of them. Can you see it? Yes, you can. Uh, once again, all PK upper, super stretchy. Really, really nice PK. This is very, very nice. You can see your socks through the holes, so it's nice and open, which I really like. Consortium tab, which is also suede on the front, on the tongue. The handshake on the inside. And then of course you have boost. And then there's this other part of the midsole that kind of, this is not boost, where you have red pinstriping, or red striping, it's not pinstripe, but red striping. And then this, I can't remember what they call this, um, this part of the midsole, but this does take away from some of the boost, the boostology that you got going on, for sure. It makes for a much firmer step. So like with the Ultra Boost, very squishy and very bouncy. This is just a little more firm. It just feels more solid when you step. Which I don't know if it's a good or a bad thing. It's neither really, because I'm not using them for performance. I'm just using them for casual wear. So for me, it's fine. It just feels like a sturdier shoe than an Ultra Boost. A little less flex, if you know what I'm saying. Um, the sole on this is crazy as fuck. It's called, what's the name of it? The Audi Wear? That's what it says right there. So crazy ass sole, but you still have a torsion system. And it is pretty cool, even though it's the bottom of the shoe. But you can see all the boost through it. I think that's pretty cool. I don't notice too much of a difference other than what I said as far as being a little more firm and you're not getting quite as much bounce back when you take a step. But still, like, really, really comfortable. As far as fit goes on these, a lot of people with energy boost, I hear a size up. For these particularly, a size 13 is damn near perfect. I don't feel the need to size up. There's a little room in my toes. There's definitely room in the heel area or, you know, you can or you know around the tongue area there's I can see into the shoe and see my socks so I know that I have room but it's not too loose where I'm like oh man if I just tied these top laces it'd be fine you wouldn't see anything um, I'm really excited they got here a little early so we could take a look before the drop drop is tomorrow I do believe everywhere because it stays 18th yeah tomorrow everywhere I think the energy boosts are gonna be kind of slept on a lot of people are after the mids which I totally understand because I love the mids as well but this whole pack is a fucking hit to me like the energy boost is super, super sick. So I'd still, I'd go, I'd say go true to size with it. I wouldn't really size down unless you plan on taking out the insole. Even then, for me personally, I, I definitely prefer the 13 on this one. So, but yeah, there it is. There is the Consortium Run Through Time Energy Boost. Do not sleep because later I feel like people are gonna be after them. Blat out.
so I almost forgot because this little guy. Um, Thursday there is a drop. It's actually, there's another Godzilla restock. Um, I know I said last time was the last time, but this is probably the last time. Just literally can't get to everybody and we can't print them fast enough. So, if you're interested in a Godzilla t-shirt or tank top, they are redropping on Thursday. Most likely Thursday night. We'll give you a time soon. We're also dropping the Pan Am slash Catch Me If You Can t-shirts and tank tops online. Thursday. I think that's pretty much the only thing in that drop right now. Then on Saturday and Sunday, I will be at the Los Angeles Sneaker Con, which is technically in Orange County. So well, um, I'll be there. Omar will not. He's not coming this time. We have Sneaker Con merch, Devils and Dragons. I think you probably saw me draw them on the vlog. And then Sunday night, surprise drop online at some point. So stay tuned. I'm out of here. I'm exhausted. Peace.